Hello, Michelle Eaton here, and in this video we're going to look at using the Bluehost File Manager to install a WordPress theme. We may want to do this if we haven't got or don't want to use a zip program, and also if the WordPress uploader is having trouble uploading the zipped file. This can happen if the files are too large for the WordPress uploader to handle. So follow along as I show you how to do this. So to begin, we'll just quickly have a look at the blog that I'm setting up. Um, that's currently using the Weaver theme. We'll come back to the dashboard. Have a look at appearance and themes. And there we've got the Weaver theme, 2011 theme and the 2010 theme. Now we're going to come over to Bluehost. And we're going to scroll down. To the files section and we're going to click on file manager. Click go. And we're going to navigate to the public HTML folder and double click that icon. And the site I'm working on is Birmingham Hairdressers, so I'm going to double click that folder. And then we're going to go to WP-Content, which is our WordPress content. And here we can see the themes directory. So we're going to double click the themes folder. There we can see our themes listed 2011, 2010 and Weaver. Then we're going to come up here to the upload button and click that and we browse for the file that we want. So I saved in desktop a zip file and it's this one here at the bottom jmintwp.zip so we're going to open that, you can see at the bottom here that the upload has started. So when it's complete, you can close this tab, go back to File Manager and then if we come up here to Reload there we can see the zip file that we just uploaded. So if we select that and come up the top here to Extract leave the path as it is going into the themes that's fine and select Extract File it's Extracted all those files, click Close Again, come up and reload. We can now see we've got the JMint WP folder next to all the other theme folders. Now we can select the zip file and we can delete that. We don't need that anymore now that it's extracted. So yes, we'll delete that one. And now come back over to our WordPress theme and we refresh this page scroll down we can see that we have the new theme available to us so if we now activate that theme and come up to visit site There we have 
and new theme installed and activated without needing to use a zip program. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, come over and visit us at the localbusinesswebschool.com and join us for our free tutorials. Hope to speak to you soon. Bye.